What is going on guys? My name is Oro. Welcome to a tutorial on how to download paint.net. The reason I'm remaking this from my previous channel is one, uh, it's kind of a milestone for me. It's the most successful video I've ever made and I'm gonna... And it's basically more of an update of how much I've grown as a person and how much my voice has adjusted when it comes to YouTube. And uh, yeah, and my balls dropped. Yeah. That's a thing. But anyway, so there's another reason I'm doing this is I'm going to answer a couple questions. Uh, but first, let's get into it and download paint.net. Ignore any, uh, basically, ads or anything. Just click this paint.net 4.0.9 and ignore anything else that says download or any other link. And just basically click it and you'll be brought here to the download page. And you'll basically want to click either on this or you can click the mirror host. Either way, it'll download it and click free download now and click it. And there you go. And in order to make sure uh, you guys didn't think I was uh, toying with you, I actually set the download to go into this folder, which basically this is it right here. So basically, you're going to want to open up this program and you'll get this thing, paint.net.pdn uh, hard drive on the, yeah. Okay, so you basically want to accept all administrator privileges. If you do not have the password or you can't accept them for whatever reason, then you cannot install this program, nor can you install any program. So don't bother asking because I've had questions like that in the past. And basically, you can go express or you can go custom. Basically, if you go custom, you can, um, you can choose certain things you want to happen. I, you use it for, as the default editor for TGA, yes, because I don't know what else I would use. I don't think I've ever modified a file like that. Automatically check for updates. Also check for pre-releases, beta versions. You can you know, pick everything and then select where you want to download it. And basically, here it goes. Now it's removing the previous version, which I already had a version installed. So yeah. So let me answer a couple questions. Well. So basically, I've had a lot of issues in my past comments talking about how they were on Windows 8 and they didn't have Windows SP1 or whatever, and it was basically saying they were missing something. One, if you are on Windows 7, then go look for, like, if you are getting an error, then Google search it, because there are certain errors that I've never gotten, so I can't really give my full, you know knowledge on and I can't really tell you what to do but if you're missing like SP1 I'm pretty sure there's somewhere and you can download it if you are on, are on anything that is not Windows 7 or above then there is no way you can use this program unless you do some alternative mess uh, method such as I, I know there's programs that allow Max to run .exes so basically that's what you should do and uh, yeah so as you can see paint.net is fully downloaded and here it is <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,